What's up guys? Steve with Scotch of Things. All right, you heard the story on this, the same trip I was on when I was out of town. Oh, it is sharp. First time using the heater. It is sharp. Um, like I said, we were on the road for like two weeks. Actually, we, we were on the road for two weeks, but we were actually home for, for one day. Uh, we came home one day because it was just too windy and we were just came home anyway okay so last week two week, two weeks ago now two two weeks ago um i had seen earlier in the day usa made blade posted something on instagram showing a new knife that they had zermino and I was like, this, this smells funny. I want to ask him what he puts in there. Zermino knives. Um, and I thought, God, that looks cool. And then I was like, man, I just bought that heater. And I told myself I'm gonna lay off for a while. I need to, I need, I mean, I just got too much stuff. God, this heater's fun. Anyway. And I was talking to Keith throughout the day, and then uh, we were on the, like I said, on the road. Took the guys out because we got a bin up in just record time. So I bought. We went out to a brewery, had some pops, and this was still available when I got done. So here you go: Chad Nichols Damascus tie scale, the T Y R tier. USA made blades pronounced it tire. I don't know what how you say it. Here is his stuff. Will Zermino website, all that. From what I can tell, so he was a cop. He's from Texas. I mean, just it reminds me of a smaller fat daddy. God, that is a thick chunk of Damascus. Um, so he was a cop, and if you look like Oh, the detent is freaking perfect. Like, it just goes. Um, he was a cop, made knives, and then, I mean, you didn't really, like, if you look on YouTube, I know there's a, I just found a video this morning that another guy had just bought one, one of his Persian blades. Um, and he, like, disappeared for a long time. And now they're back. Like I said, custom handmade knife. This one was a little bit more expensive only because of the Damascus, um, Chad Nichols. But, uh, God, it's just solid. But it's a custom handmade knife, and he keeps the prices down because they're not all that fancy. He'll put a little splash of color on them. But there's not excessive milling. You know, the pocket clip is kind of goofy. We'll see how it carries. Um, and honestly, I didn't want another Damascus blade because I've got plenty of them now, but this is really all they had that kind of knife wise that I was interested in. They make a smaller one, but I thought, man, this is, and it is comfortable. Might need sharpening. It doesn't have the greatest edge on there. It's, feels like a dull uh, yeah it's so not the not the greatest edge we'll try and cut oh it cuts but it's, yeah the the edge isn't super great so i'll i'll play around with it with my expert skills or but yeah i mean look at that thick look how thick that chunk of damascus is Next to Savenza 31 Damascus. That's insane. So, I mean, it's comfortable. This will be fun to carry. Well, we'll see how it carries. Yeah. It was... Cool. Just a cool, I think it's on bearings. I'm pretty sure you can just kind of. Yeah, just a small custom knife maker out of Texas. 
Um, check them out. Like I said, the stuff is super reasonable. You just want a chunky nut, but he makes a smaller version of this. It's, he calls the 80%. And then there's a bunch of different other styles. Oh, here's his logo on there. So yeah, the Zermino tier tire, that clip is, but that other guy, po I can't remember. He was a pretty big knife channel that got one. Um, he'd mentioned his clip too. The clips leave something to be desired, but at the price point you're playing with for a handmade knife in the, from the U.S., um, it's pretty something you can look over because in hand it's it feels just great. And like I said, it kind of reminds me of a, a smaller Fat Daddy, kind of, you know, kind of just shape wise. So this is the Zermino Tier Tire T Y R. Yeah, we'll carry it and let you know. Maybe God, that clip. That'll be hard to find a, a clip pattern for that. That would match up. Maybe just a single one. Who knows? Purple. But yeah, I mean the action is great. Oops. I mean, it's not sharp, just does need a better edge. I don't know if I want to do this myself yet or not on Damascus, on Chad Nichols' Damascus. Cool. All right, guys. Thank you for watching. Cool knife. Check them out, guys. Like I said... For the price, I think you get one he run. He does ABEL, and I can't remember what other ones. And I mean, they're like, if you didn't get the Damascus, it's like a 400 and some dollar knife. So, um, that's pretty cool. All right, thank you for watching. Check that out. All right, bye.